Hello, my name is Joyce and with Amazon Assistant out of the market and with Amazon wishlist showing a part of your address, I have been looking for a privacy friendly wishlist option and also if it is possible to add some other products from other stores. So today I will show you a new website that help us with that and has been so kind to sponsor today's video, which is Throne. But you may wonder, what is Throne? Throne is one of the leading gifting and commerce platforms for creators around the world. In this video, we'll be sharing everything you need to know about Throne and how it can benefit you as a content creator. Throne is a platform that allows you to show gifts on stream, create content and interact with your community through gifts. It is a place where you can create your wish list and storefront. And currently there are over 250,000 creators on the platform in over 55 countries around the world. What features has Throne? You can create your own wish list. One of the key features of Throne is the ability to create a privacy first wish list with products from partner brands or any other store. Share your wish list with your followers by adding it to your bio and telling your fans about it. You can also set up your storefront. In addition to the wish list, Throne also allows you to list your favorite products and shops in your storefront to share with your fans and followers. You can earn from related purchases, making it a great way to monetize your content. Now, what is the fuss about it? Why creators love Throne? Creators love Throne because it is privacy first platform with best in-class chargeback protection. It has a growing selection of partner brands, but you can also add gifts from any online store. Plus, Throne has integrations and extensions for Twitter, Streamlabs, Twitch, and much more. Now, let's talk about the benefits that Throne provides us versus other platforms. When it comes to gifting platforms, Throne stands out with its relentless focus on privacy and chargeback protection. It also offers gift, crowdfunding, and 0% fees partner store, making it an attractive option for content creators. Also Okay, so let's start by creating our Throne account. Okay, so what we're going to do is to go to throne.com and then we are going to sign up. Click on the sign up button that it's at the top and then you will create your account. Click on the next button and it will, of course, ask you to create like a username, a password and confirm the password. Then you type on sign up. Once you do, you will be verifying your email with the confirmation email you get from Throne. And then you will click on this reload button page after verifying. Once you are there, you will select the country where you reside. As you can see, there are a lot of countries right here to select from. So you can go through those and check out where Throne is available. Then you click on the next button and you select your profile picture and then you add public name and then your bio, okay? Once you type your bio, just click on complete setup button and it will get you to this page. This is your home page. The welcome page is there and then it says enter an invite code to skip the waitlist. So yes, there is a waitlist for Throne to join because right now a lot of people is joining, but there are a few tricks that you can do to skip the waitlist. One is to go down below to the description and get my code. And the next one is that the more you share through your social media, like Facebook, Reddit, all of the ones that are here on the screen, the more you get bumped up on the waitlist, okay? But you can still start editing your dashboard and everything. What I will recommend while you wait for your code or for your throne to be actually up and running, you can just start by going to your profile picture and then you can start setting up your page. 
you can edit the banner that is behind it and you can edit your bio or start adding your social media. I am going to show you how I added my YouTube channel. I just selected YouTube and type and then added the link label right here and then added my YouTube link, okay? And you can go ahead and add as many social media platforms as you have. And now I am going to show you how you can see your platform, your wish list dashboard once that you have the code. And you added the code just right here in this text box. And once that you submit your code, it will say successfully redeemed code and then you can create a wish list or a storefront or you can select even that you are not a content creator and you just want to create your throne account as a fan okay to support your favorite content creators you can do that as well let's choose continue in create a wish list button and right here it will display this wish list dashboard and you can start adding gifts or import your Amazon wish list. In this case, let's go through the recommended gifts and add one so you can see it. So let's just choose this one that is a microphone and you can enable crowdfunding if this is too expensive and you don't think that anybody will be purchasing by like one person will be purchasing it so what you can do is enable crowdfunding and you can even select the quantity of these if you want more you can choose to upload a different image and you can select the variant here okay you can also add a gift description so what is the purpose of this gift and how you will be using it but this is optional. Once that you select it and edit all these things, you can click on the add button and it will appear now on your wish list. Okay. And now let me show you how you can import your Amazon wish list here as well. So here you see a button that says import from Amazon. Click on there and then it will ask you to paste the Amazon wishlist link that you want to add or import here. Just uh, go to your Amazon and you can see how to create your Amazon wishlist right here in this video and how to get your link. I'm going to select this one, click on this link and here it is. I just added the link and click on the, on the start import button and it will start adding all the products that you had already added on your Amazon wish list. And here they are. You can click on the start button and that will put them in a higher rank at the beginning of the list. And also you can, let's say that you don't want one of these items you just click on the delete button or you can even edit them, okay? Here it appears as uh, the name of the Amazon wishlist that you have. And here it is at the beginning. And it's like grouped in a collection of items, okay? As you can see, you can also add Amazon gift cards. And it starts from $5. And also you can add any other type of gift cards from other stores like Walmart, Uber, Uber Eats. Um, Starbucks, Indigo, and this will change according to the country that you are, okay? So you might see a different stores right here because maybe you are in India or maybe you are in the States. So it depends of what country you choose, what gift cards you can see on your dashboard, okay? Also, you can even select one of these gaming platforms and request some of those as well. And let's say that you want to add a different item that it's in a different store. Okay, so you will be checking the stores which have like a partnership with Throne right now. And in this case, I am going to select, these are all the stores that appeared for me. And let's say that, for example, I want for Mother's Day this bag from Lululemon, okay? So I am going to select the link right here and paste it in this part or an add gift and then click on next. It imports the picture of this item and the gift 
title and also the price. You add it to the wishlist and it will be there. It is super easy to share your throne page with your followers. So what are you waiting for? Sign up to Throne now on the link in the description down below. And also make sure to use my code down below so you can skip the waitlist. And also I want to thank Throne because they are sponsoring this video and I am sure that it will benefit all the creators out there. So give it a try and let me know in the comments down below what do you think of it. Okay. I hope this video was helpful for you and if it was, please don't forget to click on the like button and on that subscribe button down below. Thank you so much for watching and see you the next time. Bye-bye.